Okay. All right. Hey, y'all, over here today, Tiffany wants some puppy chow. I guess also known as Muddy Buddies. Yep. People chow. And monkey munch. <laughs> Never heard of, but puppy chow. You need Chex Mix cereal, the rice thing. You can use the cheap store brand, it don't matter. We have a bag of it and a big ass bowl. That's the official name. You need a big ass bowl. <laughs> <laughs> You need a big bowl or a a uh, paper grocery bag to mix mix this all in. You're going to need some pure confectioner sugar, powdered sugar. You need some of that. We have a fourth of a cup of butter in this pan. We're going to melt it down. You need peanut butter and go cup, cup and a half, or any, you don't have to do peanut butter, you could do any, like nut butter, I guess, you could do, like, uh, Nutella, or if you, anything like that, if you don't want peanut butter, But you want equal parts like peanut butter to chocolate, basically. So we're just gonna. And you can melt this all down in the microwave if you really wanted to, but y'all know here in the kitchen we ain't got no Chef Mike. And I fired him. <laughs> so. There ain't no Chef Mike for us, so. <clears throat> Try to get some of this off of my spoon, which. Okay. And then. We're gonna turn this on a medium low heat. Two teaspoons of vanilla. Okay, and we're gonna start to melt this butter, the peanut butter, down some. We're gonna melt it down just a little bit, and once we get a little bit of liquid going, then we're gonna add our chocolate. Um, and I do a bag of semi-sweet, semi-sweet. Chocolate chips. Get back. But you could do, um, like me and Tiffany was talking, uh, maybe next time I make this for everybody, she, Tiffany was saying do white chocolate. Or you could do like the mint chips. Or then like around the holiday time, don't they have the peppermint? They have peppermint chips. You could. Yeah. Thank you. So we got this melted down a little bit like this. So now we're gonna add our chocolate. Get our helpers trying to help over with the cereal. If you hear him in the background. Now we're gonna add our chocolate chips here. And you don't have to use chocolate chips. You can use baking chocolate or you could use the, like the candy melt, the chocolate candy melts. Just uh, That way if the kids want different colored puppy chow. Yeah. I do the semi-sweet because otherwise it's too sweet by the time you add the sugar and everything. But if you have an extreme sweet tooth, you can do whatever sweetness you want like if you do like a milk chocolate with this it's a little bit too sweet but we're going to melt this down you can do this like i said you can melt this in the microwave if you want a double boiler 
or you can just do it on the stove top and just low heat keep stirring it so you don't burn your chocolate we're going to get this all melted down and then we're going to get a rubber spatula out because we're going to need that to scrape the pan okay and now what we're going to do when you get it all melted down and like this now we're going to turn the stove off and this is all happening there's no cuts or anything so it's very quick couple you know minute and a half two minutes or whatever super quick to melt this so now you come over here to your cereal and coat your chocolate onto your cereal scrape that pan get all that get all that chocolatiness out of that pan Now you're not going to get every last bit of the chocolate out of the pan, obviously. You are going to leave a little bit of chocolate in the pan. Okay, and now... We just mix. And keep folding and you want to coat all of the cereal. You don't want it like that. You want to keep mixing until you coat all of the cereal. But you want to be gentle enough not to break your cereal and break your checks here up into checks crust. Want to lightly do it, but you got to work kind of, kind of fast, you know, because you got to get this all mixed and the sugar, the powdered sugar on it before you tar your chocolate, your chocolate harden on you. And we found using the full bag of chocolate will coat all the cereal here, as you can see. If you look at recipes online... If you look at recipes, they're going to tell you to only use a, a cup of chocolate chips. But you're not going to coat all of your cereal with the cup. It don't work. So just use a full 12-ounce bag. That's what this is. It was a 12-ounce bag of chocolate chips. And you will, as you can see, we're pretty well coated here. So now I just gotta pop open this. I can get this. Gotta cut open this bag of powdered sugar real quick. Okay, put some of that on. And the powdered sugar, you just gotta guess at it. You put it on, put your lid on your bowl or put it in your paper sack and shake. Give it a good tossing. Need more because your chocolate ain't covered.
Like I said, this goes by apparently many different names. Here in the Midwest, it's called Puppy Chow. Kids love it. They take it to school in their lunchbox and have it for after school snacks. And it's made for parties. Super simple to make. Super easy, super quick. See now, when you get to this stage, you can decide how much sugar, powdered sugar, you want on it. And I know Tiffany, she's gonna say she wants more on it. Just a tad, not too much. Yep, that. So we're going to give it one more tossing here. And then obviously you're going to let it harden. Let it set up. But that's your finished product. Here, the light's better open. Your finished product right there. Yep. Good. So that's up, Joe. And then, of course, you know, you're going to get clumps. You can just break them apart. And there's your kids, a snack. Tiffany will put it in a bag and take it to work with her, and all them people over there will have it gone in a day or so. So thanks for watching. If there's any other videos you'd like to see, comment down below. And we'll try to accommodate you and make them. Don't forget to follow us on Vidme, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram. I think that's all of them. Yep. And we'll catch you all down the road.